Squaddy, uh, Squaddy Kins is wondering if Mario could be able to pondering. Okay, Mario, I think we're ready, pal. Yeah, we're here. Here we are. Let's go back to Rogueport. Oh, Daddy, please hang on until we get there. That's me, Coops. I like Coops. The Coops. Yeah, let's return. Train mark. Return to Red Hook amigo. Paper flip the boat. Get this, because I don't want to deal with watching this right now. So we got to get on that train. It's already 8 o'clock. You, you should be singing the captain song from Animal Crossing while we're going across the sea. <laughs> oh, it's me! What a coinky day! Coinky dink and day! You missed something. Something very you missed exciting. A lot. Yes. Uh oh. You missed me. What did I miss? You missed me saying, quote, I love you, unquote, a hundred times. <gasps> <gasps> I'm crying here, Edda. Uh, don't worry, I'll go back and watch the YouTube video. A hundred that, times. That was a stream exclusive. Yep, stream exclusive. No. You'll never see it again, Izumi. <laughs> no. You're breaking my heart here, Edo. You'll break my heart. You're just in time, though. We're about to go on the train once we get the ticket. I was mm -hmm. only Goombella like two times. I love the train. It's like my second favorite part. That's my third favorite because... Twilight Town is my second, and Blitzville is my first. Blitzville is, Blitzville is my first. Twilight Town I quite like, but maybe third. Alright, here we go. Daddy, 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 wake right. up! Open your eyes! Boss! God, I don't even remember this voice. I think it's just more Mafia kind of sound. I don't know. Yeah, it was kind of Mafia-ish. Uh. Mm. Uh. 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 Francesca! Daddy! Boss! <laughs> oh, my little Francesca, you came back for me. And you too, Frankie. Of course we did, Daddy. As soon as we heard you were ill, we dropped everything and rushed back. Including the ring. <laughs> Frances <Yeah. laughs> Francesca, Frankie, I was wrong. I was a stubborn old man. Forgive me. I know I may regret saying this, but I want the two of you to stay here with me. I can't bear to be away from you two crazy kids. I'm an old man now. I need peace. I guess the time's come for me to stop being so selfish, causing everyone trouble. Looks like even Don Pianta, the dawn of untimely death, can't escape old age. The time's come, everyone. I'm gonna retire. Whoa! No, it's time. I mean it. I want you to be my successor, Frankie. What do you say, Frankie? As of today, you are the new head of the Pianta Syndicate. Oh, what? Oh, wow. B -b boss You still got it in you? You're a spring chicken. You don't gotta do this. And I mean me, boss? No, you're the one, Frankie. I've been thinking that for a long time now. You do just fine, kid. I got a feeling about you. Good one. Want you to take care of Francesca and the rest of the Syndicate the way I did. Boss! You, Mario! Sa Looks like you've done yet another favor for me, kid. No? Yeah! <laughs> about that, boss. <laughs> oh, this is gonna be... Just be you too full! I know it! What, what did you guys do? Well, we kinda promised him something, boss. We told him to get him a ticket for the Excess Express if he brought your daughter. Whoa! Is that all? And you had me worried for a second. Come on over here, Mario! How many you want? One, two, ten, help yourself! <laughs> Yay! Uh, you also promised one million dollars. You come back in time to that, how about that? But now that I'm retired, I'm gonna get out of here. Daddy! Boss! You're the boss now, Frankie. You got that? You, the boss. And you do good now, Frankie. <laughs> do good. I'm gonna water him this way. <laughs> Frankie, you got lots of work to do, and don't worry, I'll keep you in line. Sweet Bing, come on. Knock it off with a pet name nonsense, will you call me Francesca? Huh? 
So, um, Axe Boss, who yes, do I have to kill first? Boss. <laughs> Underboss. Uh, I mean, boss. Uh, you got our loyalty. I will be by your side whenever you need us, boss. Thanks so much, Mario, for everything. You're welcome here any time. You're like a brother to me. You ain't bad, kiddo. Yeah, do you ever think about joining up with Syndicate? It's the life, kid. <laughs> oh, man. Alright. We got what we need. We got train tickets. Let's go. Via black market means. There's nothing else that I'm missing here, guys. Nothing. I should probably get a live stream, huh? Yeah. Uh, go cook that Waka's bump. Oh, that's right, huh? Probably should do that first. I don't have inventory room anyways. Oh, wait. We did it. We can go to Postley Heights now. Let's get that six crystal as quick as we can. I can sing. I can sound gangster too, you know. <laughs> I could. <laughs> I heard that, my ugly. Uh oh. Yeah. <laughs> oh, it's them so, again. So, the six crystals is in possibly height, is it? That's a rather nice piece of information, thanks ever so much. Oh, it's her! Whoa! Build them! Normally, this would be where I finally deal with you and that humbly trait of Vivian. But something tells me that trying that alone might be unwise. So, you live. For now. Instead, I'll just beat you to Poshley Heights and get that crystal star before you do. <laughs> what happened to the fat one? Ah, uh, she's eating. Uh, <laughs> I had to go to the bathroom. <laughs> <laughs> we got a deal, Mario. We gotta get to Poshley Heights before Beldum does. Let's make for Rogue Park Station. Come on. We got the curse, so we got. Good, I paid a lot for it, so... Have wet coops? I... Okay, the th I see the thing you were... Wanting to go for Bogley Woods was to get a Mystic Hag from Petunia, but that's... That can wait. Yeah, okay, okay. Okay, is this it? I'll go to the... Whoa! Got an email! What's it from? Uh, from the girl. Boo. Boo? Are you Mario? Did you did this email? Did you get this email? Look, technology freaks me out. So if you're not Mario, please destroy this email, okay? But if you are, thanks for saving my captured friends. I figured I shared you a hot tip with you as well. So here it is. There's still lots of treasures in creepy sequel. Of course, knowing you, you probably already found it all. Ugh, I'm so useless. Well, enjoy your virtual solution left. The creepy steeple boo. Oh. Interesting. I'll worry about that a little time. And of course, he's smart. This guy reminds me of Lucky Lester. Oh, it's bored. Here we go. It's done. Chapter six. Bored. <laughs> All aboard! <laughs> Yay! Choo Choo Adventures with Mario! Yes, the train! Choo Choo Adventures! 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 Choo well, I did it all. Yep. I did all the side stuff. I had to get the up arrow, the up arrow, so that I can be able to get more power ups for the partners. I had to go all the way to Fooktail Castle to do that. The chapter six, three days of excess. And I had to do all like little extra stuff that I didn't, you know, that I'd forgotten about and whatever. Oh, here we go. Mario's room. In case you didn't know. Imagine the Excess Express. This is pretty darn nice. For three days to Poshley Heights? I'd go pretty quick, huh? Oh. Uh. Hey, there's something on the floor here. Weird. When did that get there? <laughs> oh, yeah. Don't go to Poshley Heights. Get off the train now. 
or a sticky, yummy doom awaits it. <gasps> um, that's an odd threat. You don't think that Beldum put it there, do you? Well, the fact that it appeared now means the culprit's on the train. We have to get this weird threatener before they do anything sticky or yummy. <laughs> sticky or yummy. All oh, the music. <clears throat> I see a shine. I already got it. Oh snap! Hang on, this person's place. All right, get to the front car for the open bar. Oh yeah, open bar. <laughs> Time to get drunk. Time to get drunk. I might as well save. Cause we're doing this. I'm not taking back now. There's no looking back. It's stuck in this train. There's a girl. Welcome, welcome, welcome. This is the dining car where you're eating stuff. Some people Where's take this train just so they can eat our yummily, fabulous food. And this trip, we have a super famous actor on board, Zip Toad. Oh my gosh. Oh, I'm totally Are you like funny. imitating me? Oh, like, shit, seriously? The fuck up, is it me? I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> I still have to be here. Because, you know, like a certain someone like wasn't here earlier to do tattle when I needed her okay. to be here. And I guess, like, okay, like you know, I fault, had to do it myself. Like, I was trying to work and you started playing just as I was trying to work. Like, oh, oh, like, I'm sorry. Because, you know, oh, I told you like a week in advance that I was going to be doing this like every Thursday around this time. And okay, like you're the one who started like an hour late. Where's I could have been there down? if you stood on time. <laughs> <laughs> I'd like to remind you that you didn't Never. record last Thursday. Uh, but I told yeah, like in advance. Yeah, dude, you knew I went to PAX. Like, I'm sorry. <laughs> like, I'm sorry. I guess you're just too good for us. So you have to go to PAX instead. Maybe you should come to PAX to with us. Like, oh my god. Why are you recording with them? <laughs> <laughs> That's she was the them point. earlier. That's why she's late. <laughs> Oh, right. Wait, what? <laughs> <laughs> Whatever it was you were doing before you were It's too California in here. I'm the only Californian in here. <laughs> I'm the only Californian in this group. <laughs> Actually, hold on one second. Like, like, hold on one second. Like, oh my gosh. Like, sorry, I had to go get like this fiber one, like 90 calorie chocolate fudge brownie. Cause like, you know, I had to have a <laughs> slim like, and like, you know, I don't Tell want you. that like, muffin top, guys, calories, okay? I don't need that muffin fat. top anymore. I don't need it. Gosh. I'm done with that phase of fatness. <laughs> 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 Good chocolate brownie. <laughs> oh, yum, yum, yum. Yum, yum, yum. I hope the fries, I'm starving. <laughs> and 10 people are watching. Yeah. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Hello, I am Chef Simi, the culinary expert. Glad to make your acquaintance. Uh, I mean acquaintance. So sorry, uh, Chip Chip is my first language. Today's lunch is so the amazing. Menu today. It will make your tongue cry out in shame. Please do, do taste it so that my passion does not wither along in the pot of loneliness. In the pot of loneliness. Hey, look. I stuff here. Whoop. Mystery, Thunder Raid, food. Oh, that reminds me. I am on a freaking deluxe train and I still can't find the bar. No, I haven't bought a lot. Um, well, I'm you not. keep getting items on the field, so you barely shop. That fish was for The over. reason why we can't get along is because, hi, I'm Daisy! <laughs> <laughs> Mm. My penguin! Penguin! <laughs> oh dear. Oh my god! Yeah, we we go. gotta give him like, we gotta give him like this awesome like accent or something I can pull up. Oh, uh, good luck. <laughs> I gotta think. Have fun. We'll be at the bar. I'm trying to think of an accent here. He's gonna have like what, like a British accent? I can't do British. <laughs> well, give him a Sherlock Holmes hey, well, accent. Chap, what you need is eggs tree here. He knows how, how to do it. Oh god, yes. Accent. Yes. Good old, good old, I, I don't remember my I way back home. I've stayed so long, I have forgotten what it looks like. Cheerio, cheerio. 
I love this penguin. This penguin is freaking awesome. This penguin. penguin is pretty fantastic. But he's like a he's a detective, not James Bond. James Bond. <laughs> he's, he's Sherlock Holmes. Me. I, I have a the very important deal to attend to while we arrive at Bushley Heights. Um, I'm traveling on business, so everything goes on the expense account. Yes. Yes. Nice. <laughs> Expensive. There's gonna be a lot of characters in this too. Shoot, there's a lot of characters in this. <laughs> Quite Paper tough. Mario and a thousand voices. <laughs> <laughs> there are a road to Posley Heights to buy a birthday present for little Bubby. Um, my my my. Oh, you are the champion of the Glutzvitz, are you not? Yes, the great Gonzalez. A bound for Posley Heights. Well, this is certainly a fitting place for a celebrity like you. <laughs> oh, the gold yeah, silver and bronze. Yeah, well, we're, we're gonna get a birthday present for me, and it'll be cool. Are you jealous? No. Shut the fuck up, kid. <laughs> <laughs> Where's the drinks? I'm fucking Mario. Where's the drinks, damn it? <laughs> <laughs> Hello to you, and welcome to the X Express. Wait, well, no, you should be a toad. <laughs> Hold on. <coughs> Getting into character. Ah, oh, no! Who are you? And welcome to the Excess Express. I am the conductor of this train. And I trust you must be Mr. Mario from Room well, 5. Well. Oh, no. <laughs> Make yourself He's a conductor. at home, <laughs> What's Why that? Some sort of sticky, yummy threat? I'm I see. Crying here. Good gracious me, if I hear anything else, I will let you know immediately. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> so, oh, the train's gonna crash since there's no conductor at, at the front. Right? Or I'm gonna crash before the train even does what it is. <laughs> oh, whoa, there's a bunch of people over here. Whoa, here's that guy. Zip code. What? Should I give him, like, this kind of, like, bro do kind of voice? That's the voice I'm yeah. for. I'm dying for a chocolate guy. Couldn't you just whip up some grub real quick? What? It took the whole pot? Really? The whole deal? This is, this is my contract. My contract, man. Not my contract at all. So what's going on? Like... No, my heart cries out in the salty pain of misery. That was my masterpiece. I mean my masterpiece! And now it's gone. And I'm led to tears of aura in my eyes. Oh no, and the toad is here and everything? No, my life is like totally ruined. <laughs> totally ruined. I thought I was going to have a nice lunch on my expense account. France. It's truly unfortunate. Almost tragic, really. <laughs> Almost, huh? Are you trying to give him a miserable Muriel voice? <laughs> I guess he's like miserable Muriel. Uh, no. <laughs> <laughs> The really valley girl voice. Why, thank you. <laughs> I'm doing my job. Oh, God, oh, what voice am I thinking right now? It... Detective Penguin X3, just think about that. Mm, yes, I can say without the slightest hesitation that this smells like a case to me. But what shall we call it? That is the question before us. Yes, what to call it? Yes. The case of the pot of supper stew that vanished suddenly and mysteriously. Give him like a gadget voice. <laughs> do not worry, Chief. I'm always on the case. <laughs> Indeed, that would do nicely. Ba -dum, ba -dum. Hmm. My dear train passengers, this is a full fledged mystery and one that impacts you all. Um, oh my god. The food. A um, uh, mystery, you just said. Um, uh, exactly what kind of dish is that? <laughs> I am known as. Bennington. You likely would not guess it, but I am a detective. At the risk of immodesty, you might say I have a certain nose for these things. And this little conundrum, my dear fellow passengers, poses no challenge to me. Except you have a beak, not a nose. But that's besides the point there. <laughs> <laughs> oh! <laughs> the central clue of this case, and also the most vital one as it happens, is that our perpetrator took the whole pot, stew it all, and this, esteemed friends, Leads me to believe that the one responsible is you, you gluttonous woman. Uh, uh, <laughs> uh, but me? Like, are you totally cuckoo? Like, I have like no idea what you're talking about. Like, seriously, look at me. 
me still like I have to keep this like figure guys like can't you like tell like ah Look, eat we that don't care thing. about dinner. Where's the drinks? Oh, yeah, pardon me. Sorry, sorry. I feel the need to practice my accusation skills. You understand? Yes, sir. sorry, sorry. <laughs> Nobody expects oh, a penguin what inquisition. That? Wow, this is a detective? Oh, wow, this is totally gadget, huh? <laughs> I'm very good, very good. Now, let's get serious, shall we? This, I believe, will be a case worthy of my intellect. Oh, mm, yes. Uh -oh, let me get this right. So, what we know so far is that we don't know who the culprit is. Um, and, uh, I guess that's about it, right? Oh, this thing is total squares. Forget you guys, I'm going back to my room. <laughs> <clears throat> you there, in a bit of a hurry to get back to your room, huh? You, sir, are highly suspicious. I have just broken this case. The true culprit, I believe, is Zip Toad, the actor! Zip Toad, like the Zip Toad? Like, no! Wow. <laughs> wow. Way to go, Sherlock. This is too good. I'm having too much fun here. Yeah, just like making mm -hmm. stuff up. Yo, you tweety geezer. Tweety geezer. Geezer. Can't say I deserve such a verbal thrash in my well then or did it. Hmm? And his puzzles deepens with every confounding step. Great. Just great. Now what? Uh, uh, take a look. <laughs> so oh, wait. Lame. Wait, actually, do, do you see it? Like, totally, like, way out of control. See Adel, what? do you see it? See what? Oh, uh, on the floor. Yeah, I know. A clue! Oh, we're gonna do <laughs> blues clues now. Blues clues, blues clues. Anyone watch that as a kid? <laughs> I was a bit too old for it. <laughs> I had to watch it all the time because I had a, I had a younger, uh, younger brothers, uh, yeah, cousin, sister. <clears throat> hey Mario, this looks like spilled steel on the carpet, doesn't it? I bet we could just follow the draw to the thief. It might even be the same person who sent that sticky, yummy threat. What makes me say that? Well, uh, nothing, I guess. <laughs> Man, I should have snatched a bottle of wine. Oh, it stops here! Oh, there's a fat guy! Oh my god! <laughs> a I'm fat gonna go straight and I still get a freaking drink. That's not fat fat, that's like damn fat. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh my. <laughs> we gotta give Mike this. Oh no. <laughs> whoa, 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 whoa. What, what do you want? Burp. <laughs> I think you Sorry, need the fat burp. bastard voice. Oh, what were you just saying? Pop from the kitchen. Oh, I get it. Food gets stolen and you played the chubby guy. Not nice. What? Drop the stew on the floor outside? No, I wouldn't know anything about that. No, people, people spill stuff. I'm not in the door, so, so I don't need to look. You won't find a thing. There are several gourmet food magazines here, and one of them is an issue devoted to the food of the Excess Express. There's a large photo of Chef Shimmy on the cover. His smile is just blinding. <gasps> there is something under the magazines. <gasps> An empty soup pot! This thing looks like it was licked clean. Ugh. <laughs> Ugh. I didn't even know that. I'm sorry, it I know. It wasn't me. Dishes. So you were an abnormal by the stew that you wanted to steal it to devour more. And you stole the entire pot. And the chef was chopping shallots. Answer. Yes, that's right. I'm so sorry, but it was a brief moment of weakness. Stupid, stupid, stupid. Justice has been served. Very satisfying. May this terrible crime never recur. And you, my dear sir. Yes, you with the unkempt facial hair. My keen sleuthing instinct identified you as the correct person to call her the ruffian. Now, that's a note in your room. Yes, I know of it as the lone detective in this train. The conductor confined it to me. But we do not speak here. Find me in room six, so that we may discuss this in private. 
Judy calls. <laughs> oh, and please return <laughs> to the pot of the chef if you could. He ate the pot. That would have been hilarious. Can you get a room to six? Four, five. Oh, I guess six is over here. You owe me some fun to catch, Shabby. Ah, you found the beef. Oh, I mean, the, the thief. I'm, I'm beautiful. <laughs> yeah, ah, beef so sounds proper. Yeah. my world. You have even brought my pot. It is empty, of course, but it is mine and I love it. Thanks to you from me. Here is just a little taste of my powerful gratitude. Please, fake it. Ah, why must I butcher this language so much? So shameful. Please take it, I mean. Woohoo, service. 